Good evening, Prenos. It's time for Quest for Semi-Glory. Sunday long play. Back to Talos Principle 2. I haven't played this in two weeks since we couldn't uh, boot this up. Well, we just didn't boot it up last weekend, really. It's busy. Um, but back to Isle of the Blessed, we're through about a third of the puzzles. So uh, maybe two more nights with Isle of the Blessed and we'll be good to go. Um, I think we did all of the green ones, right? And we were just starting to work on the blue ones, so, okay, we've got our work set and ready to go right in front of us here. Hey, Game Over, how you doing? Good to see you. Um, okay, and we did blue one already, somehow. <laughs> Do blue two. Ballet of the bots, oh no. Oh no, that suggests there's gonna be timing involved here. All oh, right. Oh no. This is gonna be a uh, body swap stuff. Ah. Uh, okay. Okay. I see. Oh no. All right. No. Nope. I see. <laughs> I see. All right. No. Okay, there's a button. There's a button what which can control something like that. Ah, uh, okay, we got another one here. Alright. Uh oh. Oh, oh, I see what we're I see what's going on, I think. Crap. Uh oh no. <laughs> Uh, this is gonna be a lot of fucking body swapping happening here. Um, okay. Uh, how in the world am I gonna do this? Uh, oh, I see. Okay. At the. Well, that's why they give us these markings on the ground, I guess. Very carefully do our thing here. Uh, pick that. Ah, uh, <laughs> that crap. Uh, okay, I think we're gonna have to move back here. Oh, hey, there we go. We're back here, okay. And now we can move maybe over here? Uh, okay. And, oh, no, that one's not back. Ah. Oh, boy. Um, is there just a, can I just quick reset? No, I don't want to use the spark bit. I just want to reset the damn thing. I suppose we could just do, uh, here, restart checkpoint. <laughs> Okay. All right. Back as if it, nothing had ever changed. All right. Let's let's take a look at what we have here first. Okay. So clearly this is the right do here. And uh, and then what though? Because then we can do this, right? And I suppose then we can do that. Sure. Ah. <sighs> Oh. Okay. That's fine. Well, then we can move up there. Um, and then I'm going back here, I guess. Because then we can go back over here. Got my dude there. Okay. That's, that's fine, I think. So now we can then move this guy up. And now he's back over there. Okay. Okay. Okay, and then we move this back over here so we can get back to him. Now we've got that. I don't know if that's going to be valuable, but we're going to do it that way. Uh, no. Still this more car. Right, hold on a second. Let me go back to here, right? So I can do that. Okay. And we'll move him up. Actually, I'm going to move you over here, probably? Yeah, maybe. Um, 
Okay, so then I need to move over here, and back, and then uh, over here, and for that guy, and then over here. Okay, so now I'm on the button. And I think that opens the thing, right? Oh, except I need to undo that. I need to back up. I think. Right? Because now I need this guy back over here. Oh, uh, wait. Alright. There. Okay. So now I'm on a button. And that's good. Being on a button is good. Um... But then how do I... Uh... Alright, I need to... Okay, here's what I need to do. I need to be back here, yep. And then over here, right? Cause then it'll be in range, and now I can go back on the button. Yep. And then I can go back there, and then back there, and now it's open. Hooray! Alright! It wasn't that bad! <laughs> I guess. Hey, Firetron, how you doing? Good to see you. I was looking out at the ocean. And I remembered how Byron once told me that we are all children of the sea. And then I thought about how now we're starting to sail the sea of stars. And... Oh, no. And then I got this incredibly strange feeling all over my case. Oh, no. Okay. That's the ghost bump simulator. Ancient humans used to get this <laughs> sensation when experiencing awe. You can turn it off in the settings. Strange how messy all the senses how were. Messy all when we experience something it's uh, so pure. That is Whereas for them, everything was so wiggly. <laughs> wiggly. <laughs> yeah, I mean human sensation is messy, that's for damn sure there, one K. You're not wrong. You're not wrong. Um okay, so we got one we 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 beat one. We did one. Oh, there's more weirdo ghost things over here, right? What were these about? It's like random ass. Those of us who yeah, that's right, Barzai. Yeah. Must feel a profound sense of gratitude for the discovery of the theory of everything. Eh. <laughs> its undeniable reality does not challenge our belief, but purifies it. It allows us to discard the god of the gaps, a god imagined in desperation, and to start confronting the true creator. Immanent, transcendent, it is here. Somewhere. We can cast aside our belief in the god of kings and priests and turn our eyes to the star maker, the poet of galaxies and particles, whose language is the music of creation. Perhaps this is a more difficult faith and less comforting. But if we do oh. not look away, Let's walk around here. we will behold wonders. Elmore? We don't know Elmore. Yakut, it's a pleasure to meet you. I'm very thankful for everything you and your friends did for New Jerusalem. Mm-hmm. Well, if you ask me, it was mostly 1K that did all the work. Um, your voice pack sounds familiar. Your voice pack sounds familiar. Does it? It's not only my voice pack. When the algorithm created my personality matrix, something unusual happened. Instead of drawing on the collected personality data on the gold disk, it drew on the holistic integration manager data set. Uh I am oh. mostly Elohim. Oh god. god. <laughs> oh no. Oh, I didn't like Elohim though. Uh um so, all right. Are you like the Elohim in my head? Behold, child. Oh. The Elohim you know is not sufficiently advanced to function as an independent being. Good. <laughs> they are very similar. <laughs> the difference is that I can make jokes. Oh. Okay. Goody. Uh, did it glitch did out? Did the glitch out or was that normal? Sorry, is that rude? No, I understand your question. It seems the algorithm is even more complex than we realize. Uh -huh. Neath believes that Alexandra Drennan may have designed it to produce more varied results once a base population had been established. Okay, I, I guess. All right. Cool. It's like, What's it being like being born, born after everything. All these dramatic events. I see it as a blessing. <laughs> 
I understand that these struggles were necessary. Were they though? I wouldn't want to actually experience <laughs> them. Okay. Thanks to what you went through. <laughs> That's pretty human, actually. <laughs> that is very human. Um, what do you think the future will be like? What do you like? think our future will be like? I don't have the slightest idea. I don't even really know who I am. Nah, welcome to the am club, buddy. No. Am I serious? Maybe. Do I want to reinvent myself or celebrate my heritage? Uh, yes to both, maybe. But you see, it doesn't I matter. Know. If I get it wrong, I can try again. Because I was lucky enough to be born into a society that's still growing and evolving. Hmm. There, I guess. Uh, come here, solve puzzles. Here to solve puzzles. No. <laughs> I just wanted somewhere quiet to relax and think about the future. Uh, There's always so much going on in New Jerusalem. There. Uh, th how about a joke? Tell me a joke. If you have 13 red tetrominoes in one hand uh -huh. and 15 green tetrominoes in the other, uh -huh. what do you have? A whole lot of fucking tetrominoes. I don't know. What? Very large hands. Oh, also true. <laughs> okay, I know it needs some work. This is all very new to me. Well, that's even but worse I than the one that I came up with. <laughs> I oh, go. no. It was nice meeting you. I... Sh sure? Sure. It was very nice meeting you, I guess. Almost weird. Oh, there's somebody else to talk to. Who is this? Oh, it's Al! You're good. What can I do for you? What are you doing here? Did you know that Byron's here? Uh, how have you been? How have you been? I haven't seen you in a while. To be honest, I haven't done a whole lot since the expedition. Couldn't really figure out my place in the new system. Sat on your ass and did nothing? Yeah, that's fine. Watch some old movies. Just sat back and watched everything. Yeah, that's fine, man. Gotta be go, 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 rush, rush, rush everywhere all the time. I uh, still make one gave me the wrong choice. I don't know. <laughs> we haven't destroyed ourselves yet, so that's good. Well, I don't even remember the choice that we made. <laughs> moving very quickly, and that does worry me. Yeah. We're doing things in years that took our ancestors centuries. Fair. You don't want to rush stuff course, sometimes. Of course, maybe I'm being irrational. Yeah. Is there anything inherently wrong about doing something faster? Uh, no. Just because something is different doesn't necessarily mean that it's bad. Also true. I honestly can't tell anymore. Okay. Fair, I guess. Uh, how do you like, how the, do you like the exhibition? The location's incredible, but it's the theme that's really gotten to me. Hmm. Freedom from necessity. In a way, that means freedom from any external purpose. So? But necessity is what's shaped us. Okay. It's given us meaning since we learned to think. All right. The drama of human history is the drama of dealing with necessity. Well, I... I guess maybe. Um <laughs> any relationship. Have any advice? relationship oh, advice no. for me? Learning how to disagree is the most important part. To be on important. the same page as someone else is enjoyable, but there will always come a point when you're not. And when it's something really important, it's hard not to let that get in the way. That's I can't wise. pretend that I've really figured out how to do it consistently, but uh yeah. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, you should really take this opportunity to go talk to Byron. You know, you should really take this opportunity to talk to Byron. I, uh, yeah, I've been meaning to. <laughs> we'll see. Uh huh. How is Herman adjusting to not being mayor anymore? Oh, I, I don't know. He seems to be enjoying it. Hell yeah. He finally has time to go hiking. Uh, he's been helping Chansey with the gardening. And uh, he's been finding a lot of excuses to go to Melville's. Oh, workshop. I'm sure Melville uh, loves that. I think he might be trying to. Uh, oh no. Yeah. <laughs> ah, <laughs> Melville is gonna have something to say about that. And how's that going? And how's that going for him? <laughs> I don't know. He's not giving up. Mm. But there's two sides to this equation. Yeah. And in the end, I guess it's up to Melville. If there is a higher being, then I hope they have mercy on you. <laughs> uh, right. I should go. Uh, yeah, we should go. We'll solve the puzzle. 
Okay. Number three is over here, apparently. Ah, yeah, right there. Ah, good. Back to lasers. Show you the lasers more than the body spots. All right, we got a tunnel bit. Uh, red laser source over there. Blue endpoint and an inverter. Okay. Uh, simple bits first. Okay. All right. Need to take the tunnel bit with us. What else do we have to work with here? Okay, there's the red bit there. Okay, tunnel walls there. Okay, there's a, a little laser bit there. It's fine. Uh, alright. Let's do this, then. Flip. 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 Hmm. Let's see. I see. Um, okay. Well, here's what I'm probably gonna need to do, then. I don't need to use... I need to use the tunnel bit to do some magic here. Let's uh, disconnect that for now. I'm gonna go ahead and do a uh, blip. And is that one? Yeah, let's target. Oops. Let's target there, right? Okay. Well, let's do it like right. Okay. We'll do it like right over here. And then we'll move the tunnel bit. Such that it does the thing. There we go. Okay. Now we've got. Alright, that's open. Oh, we got a butt. We need a bouton. Mm -hmm. Well, I mean... Okay, I think I see what's going on. I need to get the inverter bit through this thing. Probably. So let's go ahead and do that. We'll do like that, I guess. And then we can yoink this through the thing. Oh. Oh, crap. Uh. Except I, um. Alright, hold on one second. I still need that to be, like, lit up. So that we can do that and that, probably. So that when we yoink this thing, will it stay up? It will. Nice. Okay. And now we got this free tunnel bit. So, boop. We did it. The view from up here is lovely. I can see the whole exhibition. Where the fuck is Baron? Uh, can you see Alcatraz? <laughs> <laughs> subtle, Melville, subtle. Very subtle. I'll get to it soon. All uh -huh. right. This has become entirely too silly, and I'm putting an end to it. Yeah, that's right, 1K. Taking charge, baby! <laughs> Suck it, Byron! Hi. you added me to the group. Was that on purpose? It sure was. Because it's absurd that you're not part of it. And it's ridiculous that we haven't talked in such a long time. And honestly, the only reason for it... Oh yes, shit! Mark your calendars. Byron and Mindy's an idiot. Excuses. I was busy. I thought I was respecting your wishes, but none of it really holds up. The truth is, I was just afraid you wouldn't be able to forgive me. There's nothing to forgive, Byron. You did what you thought was right, and I did what I thought was right. Uh -huh. That's what it's always been like between us. Yeah. That's our strength and uh, our weakness. Yes. Maybe you are an idiot. Ah, uh, there's no maybe about so it. Ah, uh, well, uh... So it's settled. You're both idiots. Hey, there we go. Back out. <laughs> Melville with the, with the truth there. Ah, uh, let's jump around out here to see if there's something special going on. There wasn't. Just made a circuit around the damn thing without any real purpose. All right, well, puzzle door, it's fine. <clears throat> the big hassle. Oh, good. Um, all right, we got an activator. Do 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 do. Laser bit here. Okay. Well, we're gonna have to wiggle the activator all the way around here. It looks like. So let's grab that. Can we? 
tag them both here? Probably not. No, because it needs to be, like, right there. Okay. Uh, Alright. The laser bit's there. The laser source bit's there. Um, oh, and there's another activator there. Okay. Well, I see. I see. Okay. I'll need to grab this laser bit, then. Go blip, and blip, and blip. Or not. Oh, because it's behind a gate. Damn it. Alright. Let's grab this one. Alright. We do that. Can we then be like, Oh, I just fucking connect that one up. And that's open. Yep. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. Uh... But then what? Like, if I yoink this, that closes up, right? Which, that, it deactivates once I take it off the laser, right? Yeah, that's unfortunate. Okay, so if that gets me in here-ish, right? Then what? Then fucking what? Oh, I think I see. I think I need... Can I connect these directly, right? Yeah, just like that. Alright. Um... Yeah, except I don't know that I can... Ah, it's just a little bit away from that. So can I maybe... Be like, eh? No, I need to somehow... I need to somehow wiggle it around. Um, I suppose the other option is do this. Okay, that stays open there. Um, can I perhaps... Hmm. Wait a minute. Go back there. Um, so I can do this, right? Yeah, but I can't really wiggle that out very far. I need to get... I think I need to get this thing out of here, and I need to get the laser bit in here. I don't know how I'm gonna do that, necessarily. Okay. My ass back out there. So, if I were to do this, can I, like... Okay, I think I can sort of... Yeah, it's sort of still there, right? Does that help? I mean, it turns that thing back on, but... Is there a way for me to get this... Alright, hold on a second. Let me connect that directly up to here. Can I, like, just put it fucking over here? Hmm. I do it like this. Can I just, um... I could probably do it like this, yeah? I just need to, like, right about there. And then I can disconnect that. Yeah, okay, right. Because it's self-sustaining at this point, right? Excellent. Okay. But... But then what? <laughs> but then fucking what? Now what do I do with this, though? Because I will need to get probably both activator bits out there. Which means I probably need this thing set up here, yeah? To get the blue bits out. And then we can kind of just walk it out from there, I guess, yeah? Now we've got that. Um, I'm gonna yoink that. And do red to... Uh, yeah, right here, I guess. Zoop. And then we can do, uh, blue to, well, blue to here, right? Which, uh, okay, I need that there, maybe? And then I can yoink. Uh, if I yoink this. 
Okay, then I can just do that. Yeah, there we go. Never mind. Very, very simple, straightforward portal. Okay. Not bad. Oh, interesting that it uh, crossed the streams a bit here without me really intending that. That's alright. That's fine. Okay, that was what? Four? Alright, five's over here. Six right there. Ah, let's do a quarter. Just in case they want to teach me something new here. The intruder. Oh boy. Okay, we got laser source, laser receptacle, button, a box. Oh, and an extra little bit here, huh? Okay, another button. What? I'm gonna yoink this here. I probably need the laser bit more in the box. Got that, that, that. That gets us. Oh, it's the gravity things. Oh, no. I didn't particularly like these either. <laughs> Damn it. Okay. Um. Well, what's beyond this gate here? Another button. Which operates a fan. Goody. Operates a fan and it closes that thing there. Ah, uh, I see. Uh, Alright. Um. Well, we don't need it connecting that anymore, actually. On account of the. On account of the that we got the grab bit out of it, right? Um, so now we've got a blue source. Oh, oh, oh! I see, I see, I see, I see. Okay. Um, we're gonna need to do it like that, probably. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> not like that. Um, but I need to get the box out of here, I think, so we're gonna go, like, flip, and like that, and then we're gonna set this up to do, uh, I don't know, like that, I guess, and then as soon as we, uh, as soon as we open it up with our, our own body, it should, or oh, I thought it would yoink it, oh, I've got it just very slightly off, yeah, good job. Okay. Right there. Uh, yeah, that should be good. Now, once we open it, it'll fly through. There we go. Okay, so now we got an extra box. Oh, oopsie, excuse me. Which we'll probably need for this. And we've got the laser bit, the grab thing. Uh. I see. Okay. Because I imagine that there... Okay, yeah, there's the blue thing there. I see what's going on. So, blip. Blip. And... Uh, oh, wait. Uh... Is that gonna work? Oh, I guess it might work. I guess it might work. Alright, let's set that there. I'm gonna go like that. Be like oh maybe we'll do it like this like that then we got this and then oh but then it doesn't um I think I need that box how am I gonna get that box out of here can I do that oh oh I guess I can right where's the red source there it is okay get that box in here. oh wait no that's not gonna do it uh, I don't suppose I can target that thing from the butt, can I? No, of course not. Is there another, another part that I'm missing here? No. Okay. Shit. <laughs> uh, where's the blue source out of all this? Pretty confident that I need to. Oh, it's over there. Interesting. Okay. 
Uh, well, that might not work as intended then. Oh, interesting. There's another. What's that gonna work? Why is there another gravity plate down there? Oh, I guess that's to suck the thing off the wall, just in case I need it. Um, can I yoink the... No, I can't yoink the fan thing. Ah, uh, they do give me a ladder, just in case I fuck this up. Alright, that's nice of them. Um, alright, so we've got... A laser bit? Can I target this, like, way the fuck out here? I kind of can, right? And if I do that, yeah. Okay, so maybe I need to set it up kind of like that. How am I going to get my butt through there, though? Because I can't target it from the butt, right? No, it's right there. Of course it is. Okay, because I'm pretty sure that I need to... Well, actually, no, I need that myself, right? Okay, let's move this back out here. I'm going to grab the box. Put that there. I'm going to yoink this to... Uh, where's the blue source now? Out there, right? Okay, we're going to do that. And... Uh, that. That. And put this on the box. Okay. Do that. Because then that goes up. But then we need to somehow sucker the thing over there, right? But how am I going to do that without a thing to let me in? So I can do that. But then it's just like, nah, man, you can't do that. Okay. of this. Okay, so I don't necessarily need the grab thing uh, in this section here, but I do need it to hold down that so I can get in there and like press that up. No, because when I do that, that gets cut off, so it can't do the thing anyways. That's interesting. Um, hmm. Do I need to uh, maybe just... Maybe I don't need the box, then. Do it like this. Do that. Do... I guess we'll do this, right? Oh. Uh, oh, let's do it like this then. Hmm. How in the world am I gonna... Am I gonna do that, though? Because as soon as I turn the button on, I'll do... To do the fan thing and it slams that gate shut so we can't do the little gravity suck thing. It's bizarre. Okay. Hmm. Well. Maybe I don't need the... Oh, yeah, I do. Because this won't, uh, this doesn't get over the gate, so I can't do that. Ugh. Damn it. <laughs> okay, uh... So I need to get this connected to that. 
connected to that. I need to put it up there. That's what I need to do. Probably. Seems reasonable anyway. But how do I do that? The parts that I'm given. Feels like I'm missing a part. Although that, that's that been pretty consistent across the entirety of Tales Principle 2, honestly. Seems like I'm missing one object to manipulate, and then it turns out I, I'm not, so. Alright, that's fine. Just have to think about it. Um, so we probably did all we need to do here. This is the area that had the button in it, right? And then the either the laser or the gravity bit was in there, so that's probably all taken care of. That we used to suck the box out of that area there, so that's probably all done. So really what we're down to now is probably attempting to get this box in there whilst also having our own butts in here. How's that gonna work? Can we... Yeah, there's no other... Yeah, no. The only thing that opens this gate is this button. So that's, uh... That ain't happen. Is there another bit of gravity plating, perhaps, that I'm not seeing? No. The one there, we got the one there, and we got the large chunk there. Hmm. Got the ladder out here, just in case we lock ourselves in. How in the... How would we lock ourselves in here, though? Because there's only one way through, right? It's this gate. And it's held down, and it's opened right now, but... Hmm. Okay, uh, yoink, grab anything out there for now. We move that up. That's probably where it needs to be, right? Because then the gravity suck thing will go over to there. Maybe. But how? <laughs> but how to do it like that? Do we need to go like that? And I need to get my butt in there, but I can't get my butt in there. Because the door is closed. Unless. Alright, now listen. Let me yoink this for now. I'll put this out here. Put that there. And I'm gonna go like, oh, I don't know, like that. And then I'm gonna go like, and it'll pull that. It'll yoink that. And that's fine. But it doesn't have the the thing on it that I that I needed to have on that. So, all right, what did we achieve with that? We uh, successfully liberated the box from the ground, but that's about it. Why they give me that? Probably to return it back. Okay. Um. I need both the box and the laser bit over here, then. I think. Right? Box and laser bit, because otherwise the laser bit just falls. I mean, the alternative is I just have the laser bit in my hands, right? But even if I'm able to do that, like, how would I? Oh, what in the world? Huh? Okay, I'm not sure that that was supposed to be allowed, but we're gonna go with it.
I'm not sure I was supposed to be able to target that like that. That was weird, but all right, I... Okay! <laughs> sure! And let me do it. Everyone doing? I'm just solving puzzles. <laughs> 14 so far. Have I done 14 so far? I have. Yeah. Stillness and contemplating the sublime as it manifests in our environment. Wow. Okay, Cornelius. <laughs> it Relaxing. Chilling. <laughs> testing the new sensor upgrades with uh, Incredible. Oh, how's it going? I was curious about those. These sensations are definitely very strange but they make the world more interesting uh -huh. and i think miranda's right we can expand them and learn to enjoy existence on a whole new level oh boy you know when i was sitting around being useless uh, i'll <laughs> sometimes i would read old cookbooks Damn it. and wonder what it all tasted like maybe i need to get with the times and try those upgrades myself Oh, there's another like little social media bit too. Um, too many working groups. They're just talking, talking, talking. Lots of work for anyone who wants something practical. No, just kidding. <laughs> oh man, <laughs> you such a baby. <laughs> Try something. Uh, exploration is very rewarding. You get to see the world expand your horizon. You know what? Let's take the the safe, kind middle ground. Wow, I don't like Trinculo. <laughs> I really don't like Trinculo. It has not made a good impression. Uh, it's not what you think we do. It's no better than doing nothing and being depressed. Yes, but have you tried? Just tried. Yeah, let's let's go that way. Probably all fake anyway. Like they weren't. Oh my god. Oh no. Yeah, not even I'm gonna read everything that Thecla put up in there. To be honest with you. Um. Ah, fuck it. Let's do it anyway. I understand you were so unhappy for so long as you got used to it. You cling to your cynicism. It makes you feel safe. An easy answer to every question. I did the same. That's the point where man, blah, 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 blah. Uh, you know what? That's actually pretty insightful. Odd plus one, insightful. Um, uh, yeah, think about it, I guess. But, yeah, this, this guy, this guy right here, this is Trinkula, he's not doing, he ain't doing shit. Like, whatever. <clears throat> Typical, typical terminally online person there. <laughs> Those confidence. Oh no. And there's so many weird phrases with the word banana in them. And yeah, I guess we have no bananas. Because they like saying the word. They enjoy the aesthetics of the sound of I mean, bananas, yeah, that's a pretty pleasant sounding word, isn't it? Banana. Like it has the exact right amount of syllables. If you go too far, you know it. If you if you don't go far enough, you know it. And yeah, all right. Banana's very versatile. The only thing we have things they did simply because they were pleasurable. Eh, you know. Human beings got some things, right? Very few things, I will admit. But some things. Um. Okay. Like, I don't... Let's try this again. I don't feel like we should have been able to target this from all the way the fuck over here. But then also drop it on the button. Like, that doesn't... It just doesn't seem right. But it worked, so uh, I ain't gonna argue. It works, so I ain't gonna argue, I guess. Don't fix what ain't broke, etc. All right, number six. Trident Enigma. Okay, we got two things. We got two things there. Let's open both of them up. We got a button. Oh, uh, we got multiple paths. All right, we got a button. We got a box. What does the button do? I bet it holds this door open. Yeah, yeah it sure does. Okay. 
then what? Oh, let's see. Okay. Uh, you know, let's drop that there. Sure. Tick box. Oh, we got an inverter now. It's fun and cool. Can we hook this up here? No. It doesn't act as a source. That's right. Let's forget about that. We can yoink the source from over here, right? Let's get around there. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. <sighs> like I was saying, humans get a few things right, but not very much. Not very much. Especially the whole technology thing. Was a mistake. Was a mistake. Alright. Uh, okay, so we got this door open, but then what? Oh, there's a oh, there's a little thing up there. All right, we can get our butts up there. With help the box. Okay, get a laser bit. We'll take the box out of here too, just in case we need it again, and we'll take the inverter. Uh, okay, and then that means we need probably the. Uh, do... Oh, we can't do that, huh? Hmm. <laughs> mm, unfortunate. Um, this doesn't act as a source on its own, right? Okay, that's fine. Um, let me pull... Uh, we're probably not going to need the inverter. Let's use the inverter for that. So this is a source here, I guess. And then we can go flip, flip, flip in a box, so then we can then get up here, uh, which doesn't help me, on account of, uh, well, it's holding this thing open. Ah, if I do that, then it all closes up. Ah, there's another side over here, too, so let me yoink this for a hot second. Well, actually, I don't want that box back, just for now. Yoink this over to here. Well, actually, then we can do flip, 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 and then boink, boink, boink. That opens that. Oh, we're gonna need the box. Good thing I pulled that back. Uh, what's this? Ah, uh, but then it's up here. But then we need the inverter, though. Who? But, uh, I could probably just do it like this, right? Point called both of those open, and then we got this. Um, then I need to just... I need to pull this a little bit further, like, over here. So then we're gonna need to go boink, boink, and boink. There we go. Okay, then we're in. Uh, oh, it's a jammer. Oh, interesting. Okay. Uh, do I want that jammer here? Just drop it there, maybe? No. I'm probably going to want to take this with me. Alright, you know what? Let's take it with me. And then we'll have to probably maneuver it up the center. But I'm gonna need every little tiny part of everything, so let me yoink that. That back out here, and the box, of course. Yeah, okay. We just repeat what we did, essentially, right? Oh, we'll need the box to there, we'll yoink the jammer in there, and the laser bit here, which we're gonna need to pull. Uh, I mean, I guess we can just do it, like, uh, like here. We need to have it to give us a source of red, right? That's the deal. Oh, I don't need that there. I just do that. I need the inverter, of course. Um, let me yoink this here. Because then we can do, oh, I don't know. Boink, boink, boink. Um, I'm gonna need the jammer to 
probably doing that thing. Can I target that? There we go. Perfect. And then we'll need this. There. And the inverter here. And bonk, bonk, bonk. There we go. <laughs> Got it. Excellent. We did it. Finally picked a voice pack. Oh. It's nice to hear you actually speaking. Is it though? Well, Neith didn't mention the voice packs, and I didn't realize I could have just picked one. <laughs> it's not like I wanted to spend the entire expedition in text mode. I don't know. There's I told you guys it wasn't in text mode. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was a statement or something. <laughs> uh, I was like, what but the whole silent protagonist bit. Like I like that bit. Don't say nothing unless you got it, right? We made it through the entirety of Talos Principle 2 without one case saying a word. I think we we did a good there. Anyways. Uh seven. Hey Richard Dickvick, how you doing? Good to see you. Uh alright. Uh so we got seven and eight left to do, yeah? Okay, over here. And then there's gonna be a like a there's a hidden bit somewhere around here. We just need to check a map. Okay, here's number seven. The twist and the turn. All right, we've got... Ooh. Got a knee-high... Well, it's more like a chest-high. Yeah, it's a chest-high little barrier thing here. We've got a laser bit there. Uh, and that's it, huh? Okay. Interesting. What else do we have to deal with here? Where's the blue receptacle? What was the name of this again? Twist in the turn, right? Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Can I just, like, jump over? No. Aw. Uh, I mean, I could just fucking reach. I could probably just reach over and set it down. Uh, why do they do this to me? Okay, well, whatever. Uh, oh, there's a... Interesting. There's a green one up there. But that's not helpful to me presently. I don't even I can't have anywhere to go here. I can't get through here for some mysterious reason. How do I open this fucking gate? Oh, oh, I see. There's a red on that side and probably a blue on this side, huh? Yeah, there it is. Okay, got it. I understand. Did that open that gate? Yeah, sure did. Hmm, I see. Okay. This is red. Yeah, but then what? Here's green. But yeah, but so? Like that, that... Oh, interesting. Okay. And then we get an extra little lasery bit here. Oh, and then there's a, like a little red bit here. Um... Oh, I see, because the green bit is is rotating it. That's something. I guess, right? Yeah. That's doing a little flippy do. Okay. Um. Hmm. They just, oh, they don't let me just fucking run my ass over there, huh? Okay. Okay. Alright, so it gave me an extra laser bit. Oh, and this one's open too, so I can get back to here. <laughs> but does that help me? I don't know that that helps me. It might help. I guess it might help me. Who knows? Because what if I do, like... No, I... Shit. Um, oh, I see. And they've even got it marked. So, green opens this one. Red opens this one, which is no longer the case. Blue opens that one there. Uh, can I. Hmm. Alright, let me do this. Let me get this extra laser bit out here. Because. 
Because then I imagine I will need to, uh... Well, what will I need to do? I guess I need green, but I need blue to be like, oh, blop, blop, blop. Uh, well, I need red first to open. No, I don't need red. I need blue to open this gate here so I can get back. That's the deal. All right, let's do that and just do it like right here, I guess. And then we can put the green thing back and it'll be fine. That's I think what's going to happen here. Yeah, there. So now that's open. Oh, but this is open. That's interesting. I didn't look to see uh, which one that needed to be. Screen's open there. Oh, red, green, and blue, huh? Oh, that's fun. Okay. Um. Hmm. Well, clearly green's gonna be that one. Whatever, that one's not going. Um. But now I need red. I need red to be over here. How the fuck am I gonna get red over here? Can I get red over there? I don't think I can get red over there. Hmm. How am I gonna get red over there? Their option is to... Well, I sup- Oh, oh, I see, I see, I can- Okay. Oh, or- I see, I, I can do this to keep it rotated, right? And that's fine, so then I can yoink that. Um, but then, I need- uh, I need to move red. There's no way they would let me do this, would they? If I like, yoink this all the way over here, can I somehow- Yoink this all the way the fuck over here. As far over as we can get it. That doesn't work like that. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Boo! <laughs> this is as far over as I can get it. Oh, no, it did. It got it. So, wait, now all three. Oh, and now all three are open. Now I can go back. Go around the other one, dummy. Yeah, there we go, we did it. <laughs> angle. Correct angle. Hey, you two. The formal invitation will go out tomorrow, but I wanted to let you know that Hypatia and I would be truly delighted if you oh, could nice. attend our wedding next month. I know some people think these old ceremonies are outmoded. They are. But I believe that rituals are a meaningful way. Okay. To well, I mean, you can our dedication to each other. Believe what you want, I suppose. I really like you two to be a part of this. You're getting married? <laughs> That's so cool. Congratulations. If Miranda doesn't have some big project plan, we're in. <laughs> Jeff, congratulations. I'm so happy for you. If the dates conflict with the Mars Geo survey, I'll just not go. The wedding's more important. Mm -hmm. Wonderful. Hey, you can do a Mars Geo survey at any time, right? The attachment to the invitation. Neve came up with this idea for ritualistic wedding decorations that you wear on your frame, <laughs> but none of that is mandatory. Well, good. Then why even put it on the? Then why put it on the thing? Ugh. Whatever. All right, number eight. Uh, the high road, huh? Okay. Oh, good. It's gravity shenanigans again. All right, we got a button. Oh, lots of gravity shenanigans. Another button. A button over there. And just a lot of gravity plating all the way around. Okay, cool. Oh, and a little platform bit. Cool, so we're going to be down a piece of something. All right. But I imagine I can't, like, target this and also do that. No, of course I can't. All right, so... Uh, order of operations, it looks like. Um... In the world... Okay, so that thing... I'm gonna have to have a thing over there with a laser, with red. 
That's the only thing that's going to be able to hit that and open that. Probably. Uh, I've got a thing there. That uh, opens another thing. Maybe this thing here? Got the inverter over there, too. Oh, God, there's two platforms. Gross. Okay. Well, uh, I'm going to borrow that simple laser bit. We're going to open this over here. See what we got. Oh, just gravity plating. Oh, uh, no. Okay. Um. Hmm. Okay. That button here controls. Uh, that button there controls this gate here. Oh, it's another gravity thing. Okay, I need that. Somehow. <laughs> How the fuck am I gonna get that over there? Okay, so I'm gonna need to pull... I need the gravity bit, and I need the laser bit to keep that open. Just pull that back. Uh, okay, I need the gravity bit, but I'm also gonna need the box. And probably something else. <clears throat> So how in the... Uh... I need one additional thing here. Well, I guess I don't need this anymore, right? So, let's do that. Uh... Oh. Actually, no. I do need that, because I need that to stay open. Fuck. I need that to stay open, but I also need, like, the... Need that eventually, but probably not right now. Priority is gonna get that thing open. Uh, how am I gonna do this one gravity bit to begin with, though? I'm gonna need to, need two of them set up, right? So can I? Ugh. All right. If I do that, I need to get my butt over there to put something else over there. Fuck! I need that gate open. I can get over there. Oh, oh, wait. Uh, here. Connect that up. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do this. Be like, whoop, and whoop. Oh, ooh, well. <laughs> uh, okay. That did not, did not do the thing that I expected it to do. I wanted it to, to like do the thing here. Oh, but it doesn't like can't pull itself up? Is that the deal? Yeah. I thought it could. I thought there were some puzzles in OG Tales Principle 2 that could do this. I could pull the gravity thing bit up its own thing bit here. Um, apparently not. Apparently not. Okay. Uh, then... What is our alternative here? Hmm. There's also a, oh, there's also a switch on this one, apparently. Ah, there's, it's there. Is there another... There's one there, too. Oh my... Ugh! So many gravity bits. 
don't like thinking in the third dimension. Mm. Okay. So even if we do have this thing opened up, like that doesn't mean I'm one piece short again. Ah. Well. Can I go? I guess I kind of am. So if I yoink... Oh no. Oh yeah, if I yoink that, then it doesn't... Doesn't stay open on account of the... Of the thing here, so let's just do that. Let's take that off, put that there. Now it's self sustaining, open, whatever. Doesn't matter though, because uh, I need two bits, I need to get over there with two bits, and I can't. Um, okay, what other uh, gravity bits can we do here? I've got that, there's one over there, one there, one there, one there. Um, but then the second gravity bit is in here, right? So how the f do I get that thing out of there? I need to hit that button, right? Which means I need to get something up there. Doesn't have to be me. But it has to be something. Probably the box. Where's the box? The box is there. But, in order to get the box, I need to put something else on, right? Now we got the box and the gravity thing, that's cool, but then how do I open the gate to get it over there? I can't, because I'm missing the laser bit, well, which connects up the laser bit there to the laser bit here and opens the gate, doesn't, doesn't work like that. Um, okay. What was the name of this thing? The High Road. Right. The High Road. Um. Clearly. Referring to the, the gravity bits that we gotta do up there. But that doesn't help me. That doesn't help me right now. Hmm. Somehow. I need to get this thing. I need to free this thing here. Only way to do that, I need to jam something on that button up there. In order to do that, I need two... Well, actually I only need one gravity bit. But, I do need the laser bit out to get that box. Or to get that gate open, right? Um... Even if I do that, and I've got the spare gravity bit here, it doesn't matter, because as soon as I go in there, that's, it's kind of, it's done. Like, I can't do nothing about it. Unless there's a way I can get... There's a way I can get this laser bit in there. I think I can. There's no ladder out, so they don't expect me to trap myself in there. Okay. Yeah, so as soon as I yank this, it closes up, and I can't do nothing. Uh, I suppose the alternative... Is there a way I can get something just in there? No, right? Because I don't have... Like, I need a third bit! I need a third bit to do the whole exchange thing with all these things here. And I don't have a third bit! That's 
kind of the issue here, isn't it? I ain't got a third bit to work with. Can I actually... Now I'm curious. Can I um, reach my robo-arms through here? I can! Okay. I can yoink things through this clearly unblocked area. Okay. Um... D does that help me? I guess it does, right? I guess it does. Okay, where's the... Okay, here's the gravity bit, right? Let me yoink this, right? And we're gonna go like this. We're gonna go like... A zerp. Alright. And then, uh, I guess berserk. And now that's open. Cool. Good. Great. Can I jump my ass now out of here? And just go... Yeah, just like that. Um, feels weird, but alright. So now we got this. And now we can, uh... Actually, what the fuck are we gonna do here now? I feel like maybe I should have left that connected up to the laser thing so it could open the door and let us get it back. Maybe I gotta do that, actually. Um... <laughs> yeah, probably. Alright. Where's our checkpoint? Okay, that's fine. I just need to now, uh, kind of redo that a little bit. Grab the laser, connect, connect. Uh, put that all the way over here, I guess. And then this. Be like, yeah, go up there, of course, and then keep the connections. Bonk that there. And then, whoop, and zerp. Now that's over there, and we can yoink the gravity thing out. Uh, how are we gonna get that back, though? <laughs> Am I gonna be able to get that back? Uh, or maybe it's just permanently up there. Maybe it doesn't matter. Maybe this is fine. Um, okay, so let's do that then. And we'll get, uh... Yeah, this is fine. Um, we'll doink that over, and then we'll go, and we'll do that. Um, okay. And then we'll yoink it there, right? Oops, except I probably didn't do a good there. Let's, in fact, yoink it over here. And then yoink it there, and then, there we go, okay. And now this thing's open, and we got the little inverter thing. That's fun. Uh, now, however, we need, um, hmm, do I need both gravity bits? I don't think so. I think at this point I only need one gravity bit. So I'm gonna yoink this, I'm gonna grab the inverter, oh that's open again too, how interesting. Um, I don't think that matters, it probably will. But now we've got that, and um, now we will need to go like, I don't know, they boink and boink, and put it right here. And now we're gonna need to yoink this here. Oh, but we can't, because it's blocked up. I see, I see, I see, I see. Okay, uh, that might be fine though. We're just gonna yoink that, and we're gonna go, oh, I don't know, right here. Oh, it doesn't connect there. Okay, how about, uh, mm, uh, right here? No, it's blocked by the dumbass gate. Apparently, wrought iron beats laser. Even though there's clearly enough space for the laser to can get through there, but whatever. Alright, so that's a no-go. Um... Can I... Is there a way... 
for me to yoink that laser thing back. Because how... Wait, how is that gonna... How are we gonna light that up to begin with? I... Guess we would need to. Oh, I think I see. I think I see. All right, we're gonna need to do like this. All right, so light that up. Put that. Oh, I don't know. Right there. Sure. Um, and then. Oh wait, actually, I need that back. Hold on a second. So I need to connect that to there. There we go. All right, now you can go preserve. Thank you. Hey, look at that. All right, now we're good there. Now that's open. Uh, now I just need to go like preserve. Oh no, other side. And now that, and that opens that, and that opens that, and that's the puzzle. All right. <laughs> Very good. But not today, Melville. Not today. Says someone who wants them to build statues of them. Ah, uh, you didn't say muck in the original reading, did you? <laughs> and no matter what comes next, I'll always be grateful. Yeah? Nobody's gonna respond to that, huh? Wow, I figured at least Byron would say something fucking stupid in there. But no. Byron held his robot tongue. Good for Byron. Good for Byron. Um, teleportation and shit, huh? I'm gonna take a little step back, think about the coming chain. <laughs> I'm about the spaces between things near your starting point or a goal. I'm talking about the journey. Uh, I'll give you my talk on the phone, blah, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, you never know what the journey may bring. Insights, cutting out that isn't certainly convenient. Something is what it was, certainly convenient. But yeah, listen, blah, 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 yeah, right, right okay. Um, oh, it's simply walking for pleasure. I mean, yeah, that's nice. That sounds okay, right? Going somewhere without a goal is a lovely experience. Um... <laughs> and then Herman steps in and Melville calls him out and is like, Herman's just like, oh, fuck. You got me. Alright, uh, well, that was kind of worthless. Um, okay. We did this one, huh? So now we just really need to do the, um the hidden bit and to find the hidden bit we just really need to look at a map and I don't remember where the nearest map was necessarily but oh there's one right there okay uh, right we talked to Elmore already uh, okay and the hidden bit is oh, over there behind number five there's also a little... What's that thing up there? I don't know what that thing means over there. That's fine. Alright, so the, 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 the quote-unquote secret hidden puzzle is over there behind number five. Alright, where's number five? Over this way. So maybe I actually was on something by crawling around on the rocks like a big dummy robot. That's number four. Number five over here. Right there. Okay. Uh, go around behind number five. So there's the gate. Oh, alright. Probably just over here. Yeah? 
Oh, there's more ghosties. Or of, uh, of Barzai. Has been defined by Flapping his robo gums here. Every war, every revolution in the end came down not to ideology, but to the distribution of resources. Eh, Our months, history right? is the history of struggle. The merchant against the king, the worker against the factory owner, the citizen against the mayor. Those we without power versus those with? Yeah. Material wealth is spiritually hollow. And yet thousands of generations have been forced by material necessity to dedicate their lives to it. We are the children of hunger and thirst. But empire <laughs> is no more. Emphasis on we the have thirst part, our right? Swords into plowshares, and the lion and the wolf have ceased. All are rich, and wealth is no more. So, what Boy, happens next? If only that what were true. Do we create? What do we become? when we are no longer driven by material necessity. The ancient mystics believed that spirituality required poverty. Uh, well, the but ancient I mystics are fucking stupid. It is only in universal prosperity. There we go. That it may truly That's better. Begin. Now comes the age of miracles. Yeah, well, mm -hmm. post-scarcity society. Arrive at any time. That would be good. Uh, Alright, helping hand. I'm gonna puzzle in the meantime. Um, but, 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 oh no, body swap stuff again. Um, Alright. Attachable fan bits this time, okay. Uh, the receptacle over there. Red laser up there. Uh, oh, there's a fan there. And a laser bit there. Okay. Um, where does this take me? Whee! Oh, just outside, huh? Great, thanks. Uh, okay, well, we can maybe... Can we jump a laser bit out there? No, we sure can't, because it's not on a box. It doesn't work like that. Uh, all right. Well, let's... Oh, shit. Let's see here. Laser bit here, right? Uh, where was... The, okay, the red source is there. Is there a red receptacle nearby? There is not, so that's worthless. Okay. Oh, a body swap thing. All right. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, I see, I see, I see. Okay. Um, well, let's take the, uh... The fan bit in there. Now we've got two functional robo bodies. Um. Does that help? <laughs> I don't think it helps. Um. Uh, well, actually, it might. You know what? Let's do this. We'll stand there. Uh. Oh, far away. My other robot. There it is. Okay. I want to yoink this fan bit out of there. Or I want to yoink the uh, laser bit out of here. Like, woo! Like so. Is this detachable? It is not. Alright, we have liberated the laser bit. Uh, okay, red. Red. Blue. Blue. Uh, not much else. Okay, good, great. Let's put that there. Uh, yeah, that doesn't really help, does it? Okay, we've got a... Well, okay, no, we've got the blue laser here now. Um, let's say we connect that up. Get through this gate, and now we've got a box. And a red. Hmm. And, uh, fan bit missing its fan bit. Alright. Well, okay, this corner is pretty much spoken for. We don't need to do anything else there. Uh, we need the fan bit back, though. And then we're also going to need...
need the red bit to do something. I'm not sure how. We need to light that up somehow there, but how in the world? Oh, I see. Um. Oh, okay. I'm gonna need that fan bit back for a, a hot second, please. Thank you. Oh, because then that gets me up here, right? Um, and then I'm gonna need the laser bit. So, how is that gonna work? Because then that's gonna be missing the fan bit, right? Um... But wait, do I even care? Because what's that gonna do? It's just gonna... It's just gonna shoot this over the fence, right? Over the little wall, and then I get a... a, a box. What do you fucking do, Tarantula Town? Where's the actual... What's the end bit for this? Oh, maybe it's up there, actually. Is it up here? No, it is not. Where's the where's the hand palm robo palm scanner thing? I don't see one. Oh, it's probably behind there. Yeah. Mm, no. Uh that's interesting. What am I supposed to be doing here? Alright, yoink that. Yoink this. And that. And that, I guess. Then I'm gonna go whoop, and grab the box, I guess. Sure. Oh, uh, boy. Ah! Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. No, I want the box, though. Alright, we got the box. Oh, but then it's off because the fucking laser is powering. Right, okay, yeah. But then what? Like, what's the, what's the purpose of being up here? It gets me a laser source, sure, but... Oh, I see. We need to use the fan to up, 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 up over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Um. Shit. <laughs> uh. Okay. Well, um, I need the laser bit up here then. Somehow. up everything and see what happens. Ah, that's what happens, okay. It doesn't do shit. That's what happens. Alright. Uh, okay. Then I need probably this, right? Oops. Yeah. Something like that. Well, maybe I don't need the box. Maybe I need to put the box, like, right here. Then I got two robo-bodies to use. Uh, I need to get the laser bit up there. Can I just be like, hey... Here, why don't you take this out of my hands here? No, I can't, right? We can't just reach up and we can't lean over and... Ugh. That's dumb. Alright. So then we need the fan bit. And the fan bit was here, right? Yeah. We need the fan bit on this. We need the red laser, and there. 
I need to get the laser bit up there somehow. Uh, which means I need the box. Probably. But how am I going to get the box without my second dude up there? Ready to go, you know? Oh, which, oh, it might be the fan bit here, actually. So, alright. I need uh, this to be open for now. Oh, but it needs to be out there, actually, doesn't it? <laughs> On account of I need to have the fan do the thing, right? Um, which means that and that. At which point I need one of them up there already, actually, to be able to grab the laser bit, right? Uh, fuck. Mm. Oh, what's that? that? Hmm. Hmm. Okay, how do I get one of my robot bodies up there? Hmm. I feel like I need both the box and the laser in order to do this, because otherwise it doesn't work. Swap it through the closed gate. It's dumb, but I guess that's it. That's that. Can't do it. Okay. Stack this up here. And be like, yeah, I'm gonna reach down and grab it. No. Doesn't look like it. Just need to be a little closer. No. Can't do it like that. Hmm. Oh, shit. jump off here, but I need to be able to get down here. Again, once I get the laser bit here, fuck do I do that? And even if I do that, how the fuck am I going to get back over there? That props up on its own, right? And then I can close the gate. Fine. Ugh. It's not how that works, though. So I. That's fine. But how do I get my other self up there so that I can yoink the laser thing? Oh, 
shit. Okay, got the box. Box is up here. That's fun, but that's not what I need. <laughs> Okay, I probably don't need the box then. I need the box to hold this open so I can get my second self out here, right? So I can do that, and then be like, yeah, alright, I got this. Um... But as soon as I yoink that, then the fan stops. Not like I can yoink it on the way up, either. Hmm. But it seems like, then, I would need to position... one of myself over here, right? With the fan bit on here. So that when I turn it on, I get blasted over this way, right? I do that, and I do that, but then how do I get the fan bit over there? Because that fan bit wasn't removable, was it? No. It's the only bit I've got. So how... Do I get this laser bit? Oh, do I... Oh, I don't need the laser bit up there, actually. Do I? No, I can just move it over here. Uh, with the exception of this thing being closed. Right, right. Fuck. Okay. So I do kind of need it up there in order to bypass this gate. But how do I do that with the shit that I have? Uh, um, hmm. I need both of these for now. Uh, so I've already confirmed that I can't just Have him reach up and take it, right? That was the deal. Here. It's connected up, just grab. It. No, can't do that. Right? No. That's not how that works. That's annoying. Okay, um. I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. Like, I can't... can't do this without... the box, I don't think. Because I can't prop the thing up. Can't prop the laser up. Up top to, uh... to get it without the box, right? That's the deal. I need the box. I need to drop the box, maybe. If I... Hmm. Actually, if I do it like... Uh, if I do it like this... Can I just do it like that? Can I reach down and grab it like that? No. Can I alternatively, uh, uh, shit, you know what, 
Uh, I still need to be up there, though. Fuck. Ah, oh, one piece short! Always one piece short. Um... Ah, man, I do need one more piece, though, because I need to be able to get up on the box with the alternate body with the laser. But in order to do that, I need to and get up there. Ah, uh, and I can't do it because it can... Because <sighs> I'm missing a piece. Missing one piece. Need one more bit. One more bit to hold down that button so I can get both my robo-bodies out here and go with it, but I... Not an extra piece to use. Ah, uh, shit. Alright, what about the box? Since clearly I need the fan. Right. But I can't do anything with that, right? Because I, I need the thing to be lit up in order to blow the thing and... Pass it off, and otherwise I can't do it like that. Well, no, maybe that's not true. Because now I can yoink this. Now I've got one of them up there, right? Now I've got a box. Now I'm up there. Now I've got that. Now I can grab the connector. Okay, here we go. This is what I was trying to do. So now, all right, so now the laser thing's up here. Good, great, perfect. Um, but now what? But fucking now what? Now we've got the laser up there. That's where it needs to stay, more or less, right? Um... Now I need to uh, yoink this, right? Now that's over there. Uh, uh, but I need that connected to red. And the only way I'm going to get... Uh, 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 no, I fucked this up. I need to get back up there. This needs to be on. Um, dumb. Alright. Can I recover this? I don't think I can. I think that's up there permanently, and I can't get back up there. Alright. <laughs> uh. Okay, that's alright. We've got this kind of sorted such that we can get it, uh, through there. Uh, okay. Let's do this, right? Liberate that extra. Oh my god! Liberate that extra bit. <laughs> god, doing this all out of order. So liberate the number one. Liberate laser bit. Where did I? Where's my other? Am I stupid? Where's my? Oh, there it's there. <laughs> uh, number one. Liberate laser bit. Number one complete. Uh. Number two, get one of the robots up there. <laughs> okay. Oh, actually, number two, get that box.
Okay. Uh, well, or not. Excuse me. There. Get the box. Number two complete. Number three, get one of the robots up there. Or, um, get the box in there, right? And then get one of the robots up there. Okay. But I also then need the box out there. So that I can pass this off. Um, but in order to do this, I'm gonna need this kind of still connected, probably, right? So, yoink, and connect that up to, oh, I don't know, here? Now that's still rolling. Okay, and now we're fine, I guess. Now, I need, well, actually no, I just need fan bit over here, right? A fan bit there, and that, and then I can go berserk and be like, okay, now we can connect up the red laser, right? Yeah, look at that, and, oh, oh no, I fucked it up. Okay, that's fine. Uh, I'm just gonna stay in there, and then we can do that, and, okay, that, and blah, okay, and then stand aside, and then, whee! And we did it. <laughs> okay, good. All right. Good stuff. You don't have to solve the puzzles for me, right? I really don't expect you to. No, I, I want to keep going. Yeah, cool. Hey, I thought I'd suck a lot. More, <laughs> well, I tried building sandcastles. But it's an interesting challenge. But working with materials that lack sufficient structural cohesion. There. Yeah. I can see the appeal. It's like the puzzles. Uh, you don't solve them because you have to, but because it's interesting. I like it when you get all sciencey. <laughs> ah, so you only want me for my intellect? Not sciencey only. Fancy color scheme too. There you go, you coot. Oh, interesting. You know, maybe we should try that new data stream <laughs> one of these days. Pairing protocol. Why would we want? To... Oh. Oh. <clears throat> I mean, if you want, sure. <laughs> Sex. They're talking about robot sex. That's what they're talking about. My God. Like, why are we beating around the bush here? <laughs> Whatever counts for robot sex nowadays. That's what they're talking about. Um. Okay. So that's nine of the the blues, right? Um. Oopsie. Uh, like. Oh well. There's another thing here. Is there? Um. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so then there's just the reds left. Oh, well, actually, no, we need to go build the, the Tetris bridge thing, and then, uh, there's a couple hidden bits here yet, too. But I need to consult a map. Wherever the closest map is gonna be here. Okay, there's the. I need to go over there, anyways. Oh, did we, we? Yeah, okay, we got that one already. Um, is there anything under here? I feel like there wasn't, right? Yeah, okay. Okay, there we go. And then there's the. Oh, interesting. Oh, I see. So the final, the final puzzles are probably the. The gate ones, right? So I'm probably looking at the wrong bits here. Anyways, alright, so the Tetris bridge is over here. Here, oh yeah, right there. There we go. These have been more difficult than before, so blip. Yeah. No. Alright, redirect that way, and then that way, and then. Oh, that one was pretty easy. Okay. And we'll do that, and sure, direct progress. 
Oh, okay, that one was pretty easy. No problem there. Alright, pull the lever. That should light up the blue laser bit. Yeah. Did it. Good job. Thanks, Bartok. Oh, you may be wondering why I took inspiration from lighthouses. Uh, lighthouses, lasers, lasers are light, no you know. Have a function. Once we needed them to guide us to safety from the dangers of the sea. But now that we no longer fear the sea, we don't. They are free to be beautiful in and of themselves. Sure, I guess. Yeah. Alright. Let's so get behind that. Um, alright. There was also the matter of... Go back to the green bits here. There was a... Where was it? It was the Prometheus Star thing, right? I figured we would need all of these. For, uh, the, the gate things. Like we, ha like we needed before, right? In the main game. But this one just happened to be like, no. Nah, it's just hanging out here. Alright, it's kind of over that away. It's sort of southwestish, south southwestish. Maybe underneath here? I don't know. I don't remember being here, here. This might have been just a normal Prometheus spark, like, puzzle skip thing, right? So, alright. Uh, probably not here, then. Um, where was that thing, then? Uh, let's go over here, right? Like, over this away, sort of? It's kind of like behind one of these or something, but it's kind of hard to tell on its own. Oh, actually, I think I see it right over there. All right. Way the fuck over here. Yep, there it is. All right, I'll listen to this one you first thing. I, I love adding a little bit of silliness to my creations. Not too much, just a sprinkle here and there. After all, the world is frequently a very silly <laughs> the place. The world is a very and silly place. Athena tells me that even the simulation was full of strange and absurd sights. Emphasis on the absurd. Francis Bacon put it best. Oh, there is crap. no excellent uh, beauty that hath not some strangeness in the proportion. And what could be sillier than a man named Bacon? <laughs> I wonder which parts of our world are the creator's little jokes. Ain't nothing silly about bacon. It's downright delicious. Oh crap, where's that going? Uh, there it is. Ah. Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. It's up in uh, that one there. And launch myself up there somehow to grab it again. Yeah, of 
course. Uh, okay, well, we can do that now that everything is unlocked. Just a second crappy bit. Uh, actually, was there a second crappy bit? Oh, yeah, there it is. Okay. Uh, uh, yoink. There we go. Oh, crap. Don't oh, crap. <laughs> uh, I lost sight of it again. Crap. Well, shit. Okay. Track it down again. It's way closer to the green side of things. Oh no, there it is. Excellent. Finish that off while I was thinking of it before we ended for tonight. Hooray! Oh, was that good for just another like Understanding puzzle, is a three puzzle sword. skip spark or whatever? Side, their side, and my paraphrase. <laughs> oh, no wonder one K did all the puzzles. <laughs> All right, cool. But that's uh, that's the blue section of things, right? So let's make our way over to red, and we'll wrap it there for tonight. Where the hell are we even? There we go. Oh, it just lets us teleport right on over to red, huh? Eh, we don't need to teleport right to red, do we? Do our thing. All right, let's teleport over to the hub and then go to. Uh, Uh, reddish. <laughs> Over here, I suppose. Or that way, I guess? Yeah, this way. Yeah, there we go. There's red number one. Okay, a good starting point for next time, then. Just kind of park our butts. Eh, right here is good. Be like, yeah, back to main menu. Alright, cool. Well, we'll call it there for tonight. We got the rest of the blue section taken care of here in this uh, second of the three main segments of the DLC, so that's good. Um, but we'll finish there for tonight. Next stream will be tomorrow night, 7pm CDT. We're done with Wizard of Legend, um, so we'll be starting a new game tomorrow. I don't know what that's going to be just yet, but it should be fun. Uh, Wednesday, 7pm CDT will be also be that same new game, whatever we decided will have to be. Thursday, 7.30pm CDT will be Schmuck Book Club. Um, we've still got Universe and Ginga Force and Sprig and Mark II on tap for that. Uh, Friday, Saturday, we're off, and then next Sunday, 7 p.m. CDT, back to long play here. Uh, hopefully the final third of this second of the three bits of the Talos Principle 2 Road to Elysium DLC. It'd be a lot of fun. More puzzles. More puzzles. All right, that'll do it for tonight. Thanks for watching, everybody. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.